So this is our uh, inert chamber glove box system, which is fully integrated with our ESD power supplies uh, in terms of power operations. And then we have different methods for how low of a oxygen percentage you need, how to move parts in and out, and it allows you to work on components that require very low oxygen levels, such as titanium, magnesium, aluminum, uh, for aerospace applications. We've developed a, obviously a shielding device, but also a remote system, so you can operate all of the EST parameters like you normally would on the power supply from inside the glove box. Uh, we have a cooling system that maintains the temperature inside the box, as well as the temperature of the substrate block, as well as the temperature of your applicator. On this side, you'll see that we have multiple different levels of oxygen sen sensors. So this controls solenoids that control, be it argon or helium gas in, as well as control the, uh, the antechamber. So this one goes down to 0.1%, it goes to zero, and then after zero, we control in the PPM range with this uh, quite sophisticated oxygen sensor. The glove box uh, tilts from flat up to essentially any angle that you want in order to add ergonomics for the user. On this side, this is our premium option, which is a vacuum controlled antechamber. It allows you to very, very rapidly reduce the oxygen level here. So we pull out all of the air, then we purge it with argon, and then we allow you to open the inner door in order to get your parts in and out very quickly. There's another option where we can have a purge antechamber where we pour argon or helium in to displace the oxygen out through a bubbler system that we've developed, uh, which is a less premium option, or you essentially can put your parts in and purge the whole chamber once.